OK class, welcome to Big Baby Daycare School. Today we will be talking about naughty little boys and why they should be in this school. So let's begin our session. Shall we? Hello everyone. I will be Timminator 900's assistant. My name is Elias D. I am also the principal of this Big Baby Daycare. And I am Timinator 900, but you can call me Mr. Timinator. So today's the first day of Big Baby Daycare School. Anyways, let's get started. Now before we start teaching, I will reach you all of the rules of this school. So listen carefully, because following the rules are important. So let's get started. Number 1. No swearing, which is another word for cussing, that is against the school's policy, and that is strictly prohibited in all school grounds, including recess. So that is the golden rule, and the biggest rule to follow. Whoever breaks this rule, will get severely punished, and will result in a spanking from us, and naughty little boys, who swear, will use a binky, which is a pacifier. So make sure that you follow this rule, and never say any naughty words, from your mouth. Now let's read the next rule. Number 2. No big boy stuff. Whatsoever. That means no using a cell phone. No computer. No watching YouTube. Or talking about Japanese girls. Or gotcha. Gotcha club. Or even gosh all life, so no doing big boy stuff. Or else you will be forced to become a baby. And be sent to the nursery as your punishment. Now let's read. The next one. Number 3. No escaping class. That means. That you guys are not allowed to leave school. Whatsoever. Or escape during school hours, which is very naughty and unacceptable. Whoever escapes from this classroom, or tries to leave school during school hours, will result in a punishment, that means getting spanked, or even worse, sent to the nursery. So make sure that everyone, follows this rule, and stays in class when told to, so we all know who belongs in this classroom. Now let's read the next one. Number 4. No talking smack in the halls. That means that you cannot talk smack to the teachers, the principal, or any other school staff, whatsoever. Whoever gets caught talking smack to us, or any other school staff in this building, will result in ultimate punishment. That means getting spanked by us, and sent to the nursery, and the worst of all using a binky, for the rest of the day. So make sure that everyone is being nice to others, and being nice to the teachers. And finally, number 5, no using the Kiko terms. That means, no calling us names, which is very naughty. So whoever breaks this rule, will result in using binky, as their punishment. Anyways, those are the school rules, so make sure that everyone is on their best behavior. If anyone breaks one or more rules, will get punished by me, or by Timminator 900. Okay class, today we will talk about, on how Go Kids, should become silly boys. So let's talk about why Go Kids, should become silly boys again. But what's a silly boy? What does this term mean? A silly boy. Which is a term. Invented by our friend Isaiah Kid 12. Means that boys are either becoming a fool. Or just being silly and funny. And sometimes doing both. So that is what this term. A silly boy. Means. So in today's lesson, today we are going to talk about how we should become silly boys and why silly boys belong in our school. Anyways, let's get started.
Hey you guys. How did it go? Did everything went okay? Hey. Isaiah kid. Everything was great. None of the students misbehaved today, me and Tim Minator. We're teaching a lesson. On how go kids. Should become silly boys. Oh hey there. Isaiah kid. It's great to see you again. How are you doing? Well I am doing awesome. Very well thanks. Wanna hang out you guys? Of course buddy. That's what friends are for. Right? How about we go and have some lunch? We can have pizza. Cool. That would be awesome. Let's get going then. I'm getting so hungry you guys. Need your